Well, hello guys, this is me, Chanakya Shukla, and uh, in this video, I'll show you how to record uh, in real time into your USB stick. So, what happened with me that every time I f forget the steps. So, this is my uh, PSR i500, and uh, it's a digital keyboard and I have owner manual with me because uh, every time I forget I refer this handbook and which is not ideal I should not forget it every time so I'm making a video so that I can remember and so that uh, all of the other people who own this device and are still facing the problem which I am facing so it will be helpful for them also so what I'm going to do uh, I'll boot it first of all so I've connected with the adopter right now I'm not uh, uh, booting it with the pencil cells so it uh, is on as you can see and uh, it, it always opens on this harmonium mode so what uh, we can do is we can just shift it to piano That is the piano mode and earlier I was having harmonium on on it. So it, these, this particular model is uh, specifically based on Indian style of uh, instruments. So we will jump to the manual where it has shown that where we can record this, uh, these sounds, what we, whatever we are playing on this uh, USB drive. Right now I am having this Sony with 8 gigs, so I am going to place it somewhere here. So it is placed. And uh, now, I don't know if you can see the screen of this one. I will change the lights because then I think that is too bright for you guys. Can you see the bright screen? Yeah, but mm -hmm. uh, I have to do something so that you guys can see. What should I do? Mm. That's fine. And uh, yeah. Hmm. I guess this is visible. Yeah. It is visible, but uh, now you cannot see the keys. I have to do something. <clears throat> now at least you can see the keys. So that's the perfect frame. Okay. So now we will jump to there is something written about how to yeah this one quick sampling that we don't need usb audio recording that is on page number 40 40 40 40 40 so on page 40 it is shown that uh, Playing back an audio file in a USB flash drive, you can play back audio files in a USB flash drive in the audio mode. So, let's see what all it's about. Connect a USB flash drive. Okay, done. Drive to the USB to device terminal. 
for details refer to connecting a USB flash drive on pin number 72 so we'll refer to 72 also <coughs> and press the audio button to enter the audio mode so press the audio button so audio button is here yeah so it is in audio mode and to play so I have recorded two files already so to play I guess we have to just play this Should it play anything yeah so I'm not playing anything it is some previously recorded if I want to uh, turn to track By this it will forward this it will stop and by this we can change the track I'm sure yeah and if I'll play <coughs> so it plays the track see I'm not playing so with, the, with these controls you can play the recording of that uh, USB This is how you can play the previous recordings. Now, that particular recording is also recorded by me, but I have forgotten how I did that. So, what I will do, rotate the dial to select the desired audio file. That's cool that uh, we have done. Then pre press start and stop button, which is this one. And uh, that's with that, it plays that we have done already and I have shown you guys. Please uh, press the audio button to edit from the audio mode. So in the audio mode, no USB flash drive and uh, that's okay. So we have learned how to play from the USB drive, right? And this can be a USB drive, a hard disk or anything connected with the USB. Now we are going to learn this crucial part because I forgot every time. So this is not on page number 40, it's on page number 41. Recording and saving audio files to a USB flash drive. So you can record your performance and save it as an audio file to the USB flash drive. <clears throat> so what are we gonna do? Connect a USB flash drive to the USB, which we have done already. Then to make the desired settings, and it is also saying something on page number 72, we'll look into that. But let's first record something. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna stop it. Stop, yeah. So it is stopped on audio number two. There are just only two files, audio number one and two. Okay. So uh, the next step is make the desired setting of your prior min pra, preference performance. Make the desired setting of your performance uh, depending on the selected function. The data that can be recorded differs as follow when a style is selected. Style. Uh, okay. Keyboard performance audio input from the aux and jack okay keep a uh, style keyboard performance audio input from the aux and jack so we are not taking any sound from aux right now we're just going to use the sounds of this keyboard uh, when a riaz is selected then riaz keyboard performance so these options are here riaz voice and style right on the right side of the keyboard if you can see here right and uh, then 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 when a song is selected, keyboard performance, audio input, the audio inject. Take it. Okay. So second part is just we have to select the sound where we are using the aux, the riaz mode, and then in riaz mode we have tabla and tanpura and drone and other in Indian instruments with which we can vocal, uh, we can practice our vocals. And in the style mode we have different styles, which uh, here it is the list. Is it visible? No. But on the right side of the keyboard, it is written here. Yeah, here is a list which you can refer. And uh, coming back, 
Yeah, you can see now. Uh, that's a better frame. Right or not? liking that reflection coming on is it better I think so yeah all right <clears throat> so coming back uh, on third uh, then the third point is hold the audio button for longer than a second to enter the audio mode yeah this is the crucial part and audio mode recording standby press recording and the audio icon appear on the display so let's select the style first can't use it says so okay first we have to get out of this audio mode we'll just simply press it once audio mode single press no audio mode and audio mode single press all right all right so we are on a style which is a bhajan style we'll change it to bright rock or something uh, i like something here Let's see. So uh, let's see this. These these songs are. one is fine but kind of a soothing and uh, slow and melodious uh, style which I liked all right so style we have selected according to the second point so we have selected the style 
and uh, also the sound of the are we going to use piano or something else let's see piano is fine right we don't have to experiment with something else so yeah piano and that one is uh, guitar is going on the so style and uh, okay we have selected the style I selected the uh, voice as piano which is 41 style is 258 which is serenade serenade some uh, number is 258 all right <coughs> and the voice number is 41 so <coughs> We have selected that now the third point is press and hold the audible so not just a tap we're going to press and hold press and hold okay it says press recording to start and stop recording okay press recording recording is this one so when we press this i guess recording start it started it's not catching my voice but it is just recorded so i'm going to play anything okay uh let's give it a better intro uh, i'm going to zoom it out so you can guys can see what i'm playing hmm. is it everything recording let's see if I if I stop no if I press the record it is it, okay I have to press the record again to complete it so simple yeah this is the uh, third recording play play so with this one you can forward also play yeah see it's recorded so what do you have to do you now i have understood and i guess you guys also understood that uh, let's step out of the audio mode okay we are out of the audio mode this is the live playing and the simple tap for audio mode with which we can play the sound from the usb but if you want to record so we have to get into the record mode and for that we have to just hard press the audio button and now it says that to press record button to start recording so we'll just press the record button it has started and we are going to give it a start with intro let's give it a better start Okay, sync, start, and intro, and then... Main, yaar, kya? Yeah.
So I have given you a little mini concert. Now we have to stop the recording. And for that we will... What? What happened? What just happened? What is this? Did it record? No. Oh no. So it did not record on the stick. But I guess it did record on this video. Anyways. Let's record something because that's not our motive to just and uh, what to do if I want to delete this one that there is also option press the record button to start recording okay and press the record button to stop recording okay and uh, press the play and stop button and then audio button and uh, there is a mm -mm -mm. USB erase no but uh, deleting audio files is the next option so if you want to delete this one the audio 3 and uh, how we'll do i'll just zoom it in to tell you how you know the sounds on the background <clears throat> uh, the, 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 the connect the audio file that is done uh, hold the function button for longer than a second to call up the file control display function button longer than a second well, first let's get out of this audio mode and then function button and save SMP or XS. function button for longer than a second to call up the file control display mm -hmm. uh, connect the USB drive to USB why it is not coming file control display No, 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 uh, yeah. File control display is like uh, why it is not coming. Load sample, delete sample, delete audio, delete audio, yeah. And what to do then? Uh, use the category this and then delete audio, yeah. And then press zero button, zero. And now we will select the audio, which one? Two, three, three. And then to execute, we have to press the zero again. To delete OK and press the OK again deleting so it is completed oh a simple delete it's that much complicated but uh, yeah you can do it on this device it do not have touch screen and everything but still you can do the things so let's get back 
to the audio mode and now we have only two files one two one two okay and then we will hold it for longer and then press the record button and now i want to so now i can but what about longer video uh, longer audio i should not do like this Achha, let's get out of this and then style and let's play something else something else because that was i guess upbeat music let's start something some upbeat music something like uh, some good instrument is uh, 51 that is cool galaxy and now we should enter the audio mode by hard pressing it yeah hard press cool and record and just
sai do peso record of six minutes or something and it got recorded it was completely original which i just recorded and uh, this video is a proof itself and uh, whoo that was fun that was really fun and i will upload this track which i just uh, recorded in the usb drive and uh, and I'll, I'll share the link in this tutorial video so what else we should cover in this one so we have successfully recorded this one which we can play. We can play by simply playing this.
electronic instrument and these uh, arabic tunes and the percussions i guess this was a really good piece and this is not a song but i made a composition or something an arrangement on this uh, because it do not has any lyrics or so i just compose something and uh, <clears throat> uh, once if i have something in my mind so i can just uh, play it according to the arrangement which is uh, should be preset or maybe it comes into my mind all the spot and then i can record it on the usb drive because on the usb drive we get the listen to me not listen to that uh, uh, vendor outside so what i'm going to say very important part that uh, in this why i'm cu uh, curious about recording it into the audio stick this usb stick because that records higher quality audio in the wave format wave format and that too with in stereo uh, you get the left channel and right channel differently and that gets you gets the stereo sound out of it when you get uh, the mono that thing uh, that aux auxiliary output from this keyboard and you record it somewhere else then you get only a mono sound and mono sound then that means you don't get the stereo sound man if something is playing some instrument is playing on the left channel and some playing is, uh, instrument is playing on the right channel you don't get that a uh, high quality sound so it is recorded in the uh, stereo so that that you can use later on in the daw and you can get a better quality sound and i wanted that sound that surround sound how will you get it on a mono you need at least two channels and uh, nowadays we have uh, a four 5.1 stereo like 5.1 channel 10.1 channel is going further and further but mono is just like too basic sound so that you can enjoy only when you have a single mono uh, just one speaker but nowadays we have uh, earphones we use headphones we use uh, stereos which have two speakers so you get that experience of sound so why not to record it in that quality so that's why i was curious to record it on the usb drive acha what we are left left with let's see we can play it i have shown you how to play and boss we can get out of this sound uh, audio mode so simple audio mode tick poop uh, audio mode poop audio mode out and then hard press to record hard press then play the press the record button to re start recording it will immediately start recording so you have to be start whenever you uh, ready to record and just preset your style or whatever your settings you want to play all right <clears throat> just remind it to remember it forever uh, so next time you don't have to forget just like me that's why i'm making a video <clears throat> quick revision once again just open it up uh, choose the style whatever in, in which you are going to record and then uh, hard press the audio button and simply when you will press the record immediately recording will start remember yeah so if you want to get out of the recording button uh, then i guess you just simply play audio uh, again and you get out the audio mode that's super uh, okay next is uh, we will learn how to delete just like we deleted the third file and see uh, so this was the fourth file what was the third file so that was something which we just recorded out of now Uh, it was just some error so we just let's remember how we can delete it so we'll hard press the function then we will go to the no data why no data hard press the save okay not with this hard press this and then no no this is changing the style hard press this load as mpl delete as mpl delete audio and we're going to delete the three number we have to be very cautious about it because you can delete some important files so deleting complete and uh, let's come back to audio mode again and now we have 1 2 and 4 no 3 that's cool and 4 is again that that arabian sound which we have just recorded tak chak tak chak tak ya dum tak tum dum tak so we have just recorded that i i'm i'm just really excited man we created some really good track i'll just upload it on youtube somewhere okay <clears throat> now what we are left with memorizing your favorite songs and everything so we can play the karaoke tracks through this and we can play so you can do multiple things on audio mode but i was really curious to how you can record without any setup any door or something just play a usb stick play anything and just that is uh, that performance is particularly recorded on that device because even this uh, mic uh, this speaker of this uh, mic of this uh, camera 
it's not capturing the true quality sound you know because uh, other environment sound that f food fraud wala and this room sound is also coming with this we are getting pure digital signals in recorded into that so whatever i was speaking was also not getting this stuff so that's a perfect way to do it i guess so uh, oh, okay let's come to this one it was always saying that to jump to 72 let's see what is on pay number 72 and after that i guess we don't be using this handbook anymore because i'll just uh, check the this video which i'm recording for reference okay connect a usb flash drive or connecting a usb flash drive that's simple okay mount it okay and uh, then there will be lights so yeah there is usb written <coughs> what hold down function key button longer and then save smp so what to do with that and unformat fall follow format and uh, hold down function button for longer than a second call up the file control display okay and then use the category uh, okay file function and then execute it and these saving a sample to a usb flash drive sample okay <coughs> okay sample okay so these settings also can get uh, saved in a usb flash drive okay load smpl so some some settings which we can do for the performance like uh, if you want to perform a particular song and that requires a particular setup like if i want to play this particular uh performance in which we have saved some uh, played some some style we have chosen some voice we have chosen so what we can do we can save that setting in this smpl format <coughs> i see so let's try that so style was something what was that uh do you remember forgotten which was that sample so that for that reason this smpl is important so yeah i have to look back into this video which is being recorded to which sound sample i was using i in the real time i just record the stuff i don't remember much yeah that's the best part of performance staying in the moment and performing okay anyways <clears throat> available for locations in the usb flash drive for song playback yeah so you can play songs with this and formatting a usb drive so i don't want to format because there are some important files also in it and uh, then hold function formatting is also very easy just with this function button you can choose load smpl delete smpl so if we, we will do save smpl how, what should we do we just press this no data okay load smpl no file delete smpl no file so there is no smpl but audio files are there so delete save sm smf smf is what is saving a user song as smf to the usb flight drive save smf user one song one save okay saving so it's saved okay okay <clears throat> then load sty file but uh, these files can be used uh, suppose you are using some another uh, keyboard somewhere and you can just put it in and these settings will come i guess this these files are for that well anyways uh, formatting a uh, drive there is an option for that this is this will format the whole that uh, usb drive and then you can exit also with this option okay now you're in the performance mode style mode all right <clears throat> saving user data to a usb drive so which we have done already and uh, saving user user song as smf 
yeah and then loading user data from a usb flash drive yeah so maybe we will cover that some in later videos when we will require it but uh, most importantly i needed to record the audio onto the flash drive so now uh, if i take it out here it is and in that is saved in this one in a wave format and uh, <laughs> I have to drop down the exposure so you can see Acha, it not be let's no no Ah, now it is visible so, so right now USB is out when you have to plug it in so here is the port you just plug it in plug it in uh -huh. okay. okay this one third port So plugged it in and we will see USB here in some time. What? Yeah, it takes this much long. You see the computation inside it. It takes this much long. <sighs> so now if I just want to fake my performance, I'll just upload it that and I'll go to the audio mode and I'll just play the fourth and play it. I'm getting it. Okay, okay guys, so I guess you enjoyed and learned how to uh, record your performance in the audio format into the USB drive and uh, this was the tutorial for uh, PSR uh, i500 and I guess I explained well and uh, yeah, see you next time. Thanks for enjoying the performance, thanks for your uh, patience, thanks for your uh, attentiveness and uh, I'll see you guys later next time till then uh, thanks for loving me this is me Chanakya Shukla signing off and like always spread love spread music